Hello everyone, the selfie's popularity has completely revolutionized the world of self-portraits and photography. Whether you're pouting in front of the camera or just want to show off to your loved ones where you're vacationing, taking selfies is above all extremely fun. There are a number of options on the market, which makes it difficult to choose the best one. In this video, we compiled a list of the top five best selfie cameras on the market today. Be sure to watch till the end for our best recommendation. If you want more information or updated pricing on the products mentioned here, check out the links in the description below. If you have another product you'd like us to review, let us know by leaving a comment down below. So without further ado, let's get started. First, we have Olympus Pen EPL9. Designed with beautiful retro charm and including a wide range of incredible accessories, this camera is an extremely powerful unit hiding behind a lovely, stylish exterior. To put it simply, it's fast, pretty, compact, and simple to use, making it a perfect high-quality alternative to a phone camera. Its pros are, it's compatible with every Olympus M Suico lens, its Bluetooth enables seamless transfer of images to your smartphone. Its tilting touchscreen can be used to capture interesting vantage points and perspectives. Its powerful image stabilization system allows users to shoot smooth 4K video and blur-free stills easily. And its AP mode offers numerous photographic techniques, including HDR, sweep panorama, and live composite. However, it does not include NFC. It's equipped with a small sensor, and manual controls are a bit poor. Bottom line is, it has a sleek and attractive design. It offers three-axis image stabilization, and it comes with Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Next, we have Panasonic Lumix DC-ZS70S. Buyers found the aesthetics of this unit to be top-notch, and its build and ergonomics to be excellent. They stated that it had a fast startup and zoomed in and out quickly as well. Users loved its controls and said that the camera remained crisp at 180p, even in low light conditions. Its pros are, its 166K dot electronic viewfinder allows easier viewing in sunny outdoor conditions. Its lens control ring enables quicker and more intuitive operation of different functions. Its Wi-Fi and 180 degree touch enabled front flip up screen simplifies selfie photography. Its Venus engine ensures stunning images with minimal noise in dimly lit conditions as well. And its 23MP MOS sensor and a 5-axis hybrid optical image stabilizer ensure stunning image quality. However, the sensor is a bit small, the grip is a little slippery, and the viewfinder can be improved. Bottom line is, it offers quick and intuitive operation. It's perfectly suited to take selfies and it has a 180-degree front flip-up feature. Next, we have best for the money, Sun Leo Digital Camera Vlogging Camera. This unit stands out to us for several different reasons. Firstly, its 3-inch LCD display can be rotated 180 degrees, allowing users to see themselves when taking a selfie. Secondly, it has an excellent focus range that starts from 1.6 feet and goes up to infinity. Lastly, it can be easily plugged into a USB, allowing quick and easy transfer of files. Its pros are, it's extremely easy to navigate and operate. Its 800 mAh Li-Ion battery ensures a long battery life. It supports 24 MP picture resolution and 2.7K video resolution. Its face beauty, white balance, and built-in face detection improve image quality and its compact, sturdy, and lightweight design make it easier to carry around when traveling. However, it lacks optical image stabilization and it does not have an external microphone port. Bottom line is, it's the best for the money, it's easy to share files, and it has a compact and sturdy design. Next we have runner-up, Panasonic Lumix LX10 4K Digital Camera. This model primarily stands out to us because of its incredible performance. It starts up quickly and boasts one of the company's most responsive touchscreens. It also features depth from defocus, resulting in an impressive autofocus. Along with being extremely good at subject tracking and recognition, it also delivers excellent raw performance and impressive video quality. Its pros are, its Wi-Fi connectivity and USB charging make traveling easy. 
Its 3-inch touch-enabled LCD display tilts upwards, allowing for easy selfie photos. Its f1.4 2.8 Vario Summilux lens captures stunning images and adds a lovely bokeh effect. Its 4K HD video, internal focus stacking, and 4K post focus enable users to record 30fps photos. And its 20.1 megapixel sensor and optical image stabilizer delivers brighter and more colorful photos. However, the grip is a bit slippery. The battery life is mediocre, and it lacks an electronic viewfinder. Bottom line is, it tilts upward 180 degrees. It gives bright photo quality, and it comes with USB charging ability. Finally, we have best overall, Sony RX103. This unit competes with the most recent selfie cameras, combining outstanding image quality, face detection technology, extremely fast shooting speeds, and a screen that can tilt upwards. It is the perfect unit for vlogging and selfies. It features a dual recording mode, allowing it to capture 17 MP stills while shooting full HD video at the same time. Its pros are, it has continuous shooting of up to 10 FPS. Its pop-up electronic viewfinder allows eye-level framing. Its photographs maintain soft background defocus, even when they're zoomed in. Its extremely fast Bions X processor enhances accuracy and speed for both stills and HD video and its back-illuminated technology and column A slash D conversion increase light sensitivity and reduce noise levels. However, it lacks a touchscreen display, and it does not feature manual selection of AF points. Bottom line is, it features a pop-up electronic viewfinder, it has a 30-inch tiltable LCD, and its internal processor enhances speed and accuracy. There you have it, our top five best selfie cameras on the market. Check out the links in the description below for detailed information and latest pricing. If you thought this video was helpful, please smash that like button and consider subscribing. If you didn't, let me know why in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.